We got ourselves a beach episode where everyone wants to kind of, you know, peek at all the girl designs. And yes, even Glenn was kind of doing it, but there was a point where he stopped the kids from, you know, sneaking into the girl's dorm at night. So I, at least we got that going. Plot wise, though, what's actually happening? Riel is getting accustomed to our school. Riel is kind of dangerous. She seems almost Yandere like. I thought that she was a Kudere, and she is a Kudere, but it's looking like a Kudere Yandere hybrid where she wants to protect. Um. <laughs> Holy shit, Glenn, sorry, it's been a while. She wants to protect Glenn no matter what because he was feeling so sad and depressed back during the army time. So now, even Sisti and Rumia is looking like fucking competition and, and, and Real is like, I'ma fucking kill them, but it's relaxed. And then there is the sibling, right? Real has an older brother that was mentioned, which showed up at the end of the episode with the divine wisdom people, the maid, you know, remember the maid from the last talk? She's still here. The brother is here. It looks like there was some kind of fallout. Let's begin today's reaction. We're doing mountain hiking? Cardio? Research lab. Ryo wants to kill you. The man you thirst over, sister? You are so thirsty for gl- Oh! Oh! We ain't friend. You disrespect Glenn like that. She doesn't like it, right? When they shit talk Glenn. <laughs> She's popping off! The quiet girl is popping off! Hey, what did we do to you? But we were eating desserts and having a cunny time last episode! It's, it's because of Glenn. I'm not sure if it's because they respect disrespected Glenn, but probably because they've kind of just took Glenn from her and she wants to protect Glenn and he should be mine kind of possession obsessive kind of thing. Yeah, she's fucking crazy right now. Research lab? The fool and the star. Tarot cards. So I'm gonna assume real has the star. Bald! Real! <laughs> it's comically funny how much of an emo person real being is right now, bro. Look, she's in the shadows too, just like in the corner by herself looking at the ground. <laughs> real, come on! Okay. That was a weird look, huh? That was... What was he? He looked... Traitors? Traitors. Divine wisdom traitors implanted to seek Arumia. Is that what's going on here? What's going on? That was weird there. <laughs> what do you mean nothing? The cameraman focused on Baldi. He gave us a side eye and then there was a specific sound effect that hinted that he's a bad person. Oh. Yo. That's what I think too. I feel like this is a fucking abomination to mankind to make chimeras like this. Something about this just feels wrong. This feels kind of fucked. Like, look at that. Like, oh, I don't know. Oh, reviving. Project to revive the Empire lost the grand project. This sounds fucking insane. Like a really important plot point. Oh, sorry. Time to switch headsets. でも、it's not the real person, though. Did they say Riel's brother died? Did they? 
I forget. I, 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 they mentioned Riel's brother before. Did they ever mention him dying? I'm wondering if the one that we saw last episode is a copy of the copy, like right now. I don't know. What's the point of that then? Well, I do know what's the point. Because people can just get sacrificed to revive one person. But like, the grandfather. Could we bring back grandfather? Probably never gonna happen. But I bet divine wisdom is trying to pursue that. Yeah, exactly, right here. Okay. Wonder who they revived then. Original magic? What the fuck is original magic? <laughs> who has it? Rumia has original magic? Did Rumia amplify? I don't fucking know. The Fool? Tarot cards? Original magic? I don't know. But like Divine Wisdom, they completed their research. Actually, they don't even need Rumia then. I don't know where I'm going with this. Tarot cards. <laughs> Real. Real. <laughs> Real. Guys, do you think Real's depressed? I, I can't tell. I, I can't tell if Real's in a bad mood today or not. I don't know. They just keep showing her in the distance just by herself. Just being a fucking Sasuke in the corner. Hmm. Wait, what's going on, Real? <laughs> Oh. oh. Does not give a fuck. Yes, I can. They didn't take Glenn. What do you mean? Uh, I. It's a harem. You can join. My girl, please stop crying. She is just a fucking dumb kid, huh? Like straight up. She is just a dumb child that really are, isn't emotionally like matured enough to understand that Sisti and Rumia aren't stealing Glenn. If anything, Sisti and Rumia made Glenn happier and is able to smile. It's just... How do we tell this kid that? Yeah. <laughs> if I was them, I would have lost patience a long time ago and it says, Fuck them, kids. You want to be a stupid child? Be a stupid child in the corner. That's <laughs> My Kudere, please stop crying! Oh, brother? Look at the symbol here. Look at this symbol here. 1035 we're at. Yeah. Same symbol, same symbol. So they're from the same lab? I don't know what that symbol represents. I don't think it's Divine Wisdom. As if he would rep Divine Wisdom's symbol on his fucking lab coat. This is probably like the lab shit, right? But clearly he has the same mark as Big Bro right now, right? It's the same fucking mark. I mean, they must... He was also working at the lab then? I... Real's brother would? He... Is he supposed to be dead? Is he dead? I don't know. Is he the one that's resurrected? I can't remember if they ever declared Ryo's brother was dead or not. Hey, he's still here too. Ryo's partner. Nade's here too, right? There she is. She's still wearing the maid outfit. Okay. 
Unfortunately, I'm not interested in cheap women like you. I'm only interested in lollies like real. Come on, Albert! <laughs> Rip forest! Rip all the trees! Spirit of the night? You still want a night with her? <laughs> you still want a night with? You, you still want a night with her, man? I uh, kind of scary. She's fucking insane. She doesn't even care about the burns on her face. <laughs> They're all women dolls too. All the necromancer summons right now, they're all just like titties and ass he just destroyed. <laughs> What's he using? What is she on? Akashic Records! I'm waiting! I don't think she's gonna die. She's probably gonna get away. She's jealous that Glenn is completely taken by you guys. What happened, bro? She wasn't. Someone's stalking us out the window? No. Got it. So he was dead, but he got resurrected. 100% they did that. So this is a clone of a clone of a clone or some whatever the explanation that was. Multiple human sacrifices needed to be done as well, but this is clearly the resurrected brother. The organization. リエル、君は亡命に成功し、自由を手にすることができた。だけど僕は、ルミア・ティンジェルだ。I thought Riel's brother might do something like, please let me rest in peace, you need to kill me or something, but it's like, nah, I'm a gas like you, we need Rumia, go kidnap Rumia. Riel, come on! I feel bad. Like, yes, she's fucking stupid, I know, but she's also gonna be manipulated by her dead brother who came back is now guilt tripping her. Let's like, of course she's gonna do it now. Glen Sensei, friends! <laughs> Abandon him again. You did it once, you can do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you're not even trying to hide it. You have the same fucking symbol on your jacket. I swear to fucking god, if Riel takes out Glenn right here while getting behind Glenn, like... It looks like Riel is getting behind to hide, but like, if she's gonna take out Glenn right now, fuck me, dude. What was that purple lightning, bro? She got the sword out, I think. She is retarded. <laughs> I'm sorry, she is fucking so stupid, bro. Like, Glenn literally gave you the entire explanation of what's happening. We even talked about the evil resurrection stuff like that. But like, fuck, dude, come on, real. It's expected. What am I, you know, what am I hoping more from a girl that's emotionally stunted, still a child? That's a whole ass hole. <laughs> Your entire fucking Sasuke arc, your entire I am an Avenger arc, because Rumia and Sisti took Glenn from you? I thought you cared about Glenn! The entire I am an Avenger was because you took Glenn from me, and then it's like Big Bro shows up, kill Glenn. No, sorry, take Rumia, and, and Rumia just takes Glenn out just without any hesitation. The fool, we are a fool. 
She sounds more robotic than not. Maybe she's mind controlled. Who knows? Oh, nice eye. Can you just do that? <laughs> okay, the mate's pretty funny. The bait is fucking all over the place. <laughs> she switched up so quick. Oh, that's too bad. It's good point. Goodbye. One. Switch up. I actually love the maid, bro. Uh oh, is she going for a roomie and sisty next? <laughs> uh oh! Rumia! Sorry, sorry, sisty! What? Is he stabbed? Oh! <laughs> Double kill! But, like, that's a lot of fucking blood. What did you do? Stab her in the stomach? It's a lot of blood. Real's fucking pissing me off now, man. This is so fucking annoying how she got controlled like this. That's his blood. Divine wisdom. She doesn't even know their name. Actually, I'm um, part of the uh, researchers of... Uh, um, anyways, I'm your enemy. Sissy, fight back! Sissy, fight back! I think that Riel's probably stronger, right? She has no resolve to kill. She doesn't have the resolve to kill, man. Just a kid. Just a kid from school, you know? I mean, Riel is stupid, but she has experience. Combat experience, military stuff, right? Like, we, she, she's just a child. She can't do this. Sisty, just shoot! Dark side of magic. That's what she was doing the entire time. Or should I be doing this? Yep. I mean, I don't expect Sissy to, to be able to do it. It would have been cool if she did some bullshit main character kind of thing in an anime. It's like, okay, you know, I'm gonna save everybody. Woo! But I guess this is more realistic, right? Because, like, she's just a student. She has no combat experience. This is probably crazy for her. So, it is what it is. Who's gonna save us? Albert? Albert's still around. Who else is around? Glenn is down. That's an excuse you're making. I think you're coping. You're justifying. You know. You know. You know. Shironeko, come on! Albert! Then what do we use? Is a Sisti and Albert gonna clutch? Come on, Sisti! If you wanna kill them, not keep crying. <laughs> if you wanna kill them, not keep fucking crying and having a panic attack, bitch. Okay. I don't know, what can we do? Why magic ritual? Which you have. Why magic revival? CPR, Sisti. He just called him a wuss. He, Albert was literally like, damn, he stopped breathing. What a fucking pussy, bro. Look. Look, look. <laughs> His breathing stopped completely. Wuss. Okay. Mouth to mouth incoming! Alright! Yes. Summoning Jutsu! Here we go. <laughs> Come on, the resolve to kiss! It's happening, bro! 
<laughs> it's fucking happening, bro. I mean, listen, it's CPR, guys. It's CPR. Get serious. Glenn might die here. This needs to happen, okay? Rumia is tied up again, bro. I swear to God, bro. We keep doing this shit. Rumia saved the fucking princess arc, bro. She always gets fucking kidnapped and fucking taken away, tied up. Then we have to come back and save her ass. <laughs> She switched out of the e school uniform. I did. What? They cut her off. There it is. Now, I wonder if Real like, intentionally stabbed Glenn through a part where it was not lethal. Because, like, if she wanted to kill, she could have just chopped his head off. She could have, like, hit him in the heart. But she intentionally went for the right side rather than the left side where the heart is. Which makes me think, like, maybe Riel is setting something up. She's too stupid to set something up. But maybe, just maybe, she intentionally didn't kill him so that we could do something next episode. I don't know. But that's pretty much the episode. We have the Divine Wisdom Researchers. We talked about the magic of, like, resurrection and how you need sacrifices. Riel's big brother died. Apparently, Riel abandoned him. I doubt it's that simple. I bet that it was pretty much over and we didn't think that he could survive. And then, you know, the Divine Wisdom resurrected him specifically. I wonder why him specifically. And then... Now he's back and manipulating Riel because she's fucking stupid and it's not her fault. She's a mentally child, right? It's just, it's just annoying that she's just doing all this shit. It's, it's after a whole episode of just fucking having fun times and eating sweet desserts. And I'm sure we're going to go back to that next episode. But it's like, god damn, Riel, you're really doing all this shit. Today's episode's MVP, I think, goes to Albert. I love how nonchalant Albert is just casually destroying Eleanor and even saying stuff to like, you know, to Glenn is like, oh, he stops breathing? Fuck, that's annoying. Come on, sissy, you want him to die? Keep crying, bitch. Like, Albert is such a pragmatic giga chat. He just says what's on his mind. It's like, holy sh dude, relax. But it's pretty funny to me. But that's it from me. If you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for more content. And until next time, take care.